have just received your Fannenberg Patrol PA20 Audible Alarm. For ease of installation, it comes standard from the factory, unfastened, along with a cable gland for IP66, and an instruction manual. The product features of the Patrol PA20 are as follows. Superior acoustic penetration, there is a 120 decibel nominal sound pressure level, the selectable audible notifications, there are 80 alarm tones with four stages for distinctive signaling of specific events. There is very easy mounting of the unit for surface or flush panel mounting. It is IP66 ingress protected. It operates in all weather conditions and withstands hose directed spray during washdown. There is intelligent installation screw terminal strip located in the base box portion allowing easy one person installation. Improved acoustic driver. There's superior sound penetration through walls, doors and other obstructions. For a fast, easy and safe installation, wires can be run through one of the knockouts provided on the top, the bottom, either side and on the back of the unit. For mounting, there are the two mounting ears on either side of the unit, as well as a pre-marked template for electrical boxes worldwide. Electrical wires are then brought through the cable gland and connected to the green terminal block. Tones and dip switch settings can be located in the back of your manual, as well as on the Fannenberg USA website. On the Patrol Tone Chart page, you can listen and find the best tone for your application. As you just saw on the website, we will be selecting Tone 2, which is located in the back cover of your PA20 manual, along with the corresponding dip switch setting located down below. To set your PA20 to Tone number 2, Simply change the number one switch on your dip switch to on. The volume control for the PA20 is located here on the control board. It comes standard from the factory, turned all the way up. To adjust it to your liking, simply use a screwdriver to turn the knob. Mounting is very easy as seen by this demonstration. And then the nose cone is simply added into place. Turn the fasteners to tighten it down to the back of the unit. And you're all set.